Religious freedom, freedom of speech, often referred to as our first freedoms. How important are they to you as an American? What if they were taken away? Would you miss them? Well, you may not have to wait very long to find out. I'm holding in my hand the latest assault on our first freedoms. It's called ENDA, the Employment Non-Discrimination Act. I call it the end of religious liberty and free speech in America. Everyone who has at all their finger on the pulse of culture knows full well what's ahead. We should be protecting people from discrimination based on actions and not on perception. All 2,500 employees of Christian Horizons were required to go through human rights training. The, the immediate threat to employers if this law passes and is enacted is serious. So the economic burden on Christian organizations will be enormous from the very outset. What will happen if INDA passes is every one of those institutions could be in jeopardy. One of the side effects of this, of this uh, entire ordeal for us is that we no longer do weddings here. ENDA, hate crimes, these legislative strategies are designed, I think, to force Americans to change their opinions and have their uh, opinions and worldviews chilled if they don't. No one ever imagines that they're going to lose their job because of their religious beliefs. We have to always be fearful when the government mandates behavior that will constrain our speech. And in the case of ENDA, if passed, it will clearly constrain the free speech and free exercise rights of religious organizations. Put an end to ENDA. Go to frcaction.org.